It's an exciting time in your business. You've added your first team member, woohoo, go you. But now you're wondering, how the heck do I start working with them in Asana? How do I assign them tasks? How do I get them into my Asana account, right? Don't worry, it's simple, and I'm gonna show you how in this video. <laughs> Hi, my name is Samantha. I am all about helping you save time and mental energy in your online business. So if that is something you're interested in, please hit the subscribe button. I am so happy to have you here. Thank you so much for watching. All right, let's get into this tutorial. <laughs> All right, so there are several different ways that you can add a team member to Asana. So the first way is with this plus sign, you can just click that and then click invite. And then here you can choose which team you want to invite them to. You can choose which projects you want within that team. Um, and then you just type your, their email address here and then click send and they will automatically be added to that team and that project, whichever you selected up here. Um, and then those are the only things that they will be able to see within your Asana organization. The next way that you can add a team member to your Asana account is you can go right into a team and add them to that particular team. So you can do that by scrolling over and you'll see this invite teammates option. This is with the new version of Asana. If you haven't been upgraded to it yet, it's very similar in the old version. Um, I believe it's like the three dots and then there's the faces underneath. You can click, I believe too. Um, and I'm forgetting now <laughs> what the old version is like, but just in case, um, it's a similar process. So just look for that invite option. But with the this new upgrade um, and this is the new way to do it. You scroll over and this invite teammates and then you click one of these here and then you can add them to certain projects within the team or just to the team itself. And then you just type in their email address here and click send. You can also right click on the team and do invite teammates and go through that same process. You'll see here there's also an option to send them a link. I just find it easier to just add them by email and then they're automatically added. All they have to do is accept the invite. You can also click into the team and add a member here. I told you there's like a million ways <laughs> to do this, but I'm just going to go through them all so that you can um, choose which way works best for you. And depending where you are working at that current time, different ways might work for you, right? So you can also do it right within a team if you click this add member right here and go through that exact same process. You can also do it right within a project. So there's an option here. You can add, you see if you scroll over, it says add members. So you'll click there. You will go through that same um, process. You will invite them, but well, not the same process, I guess, because you're not choosing the, the team in the project because you're already in the project, but you still add them by an email. And then alternatively, you can click this big blue share button and do the same thing with that. And then also if if you have added them to your overall account or somewhere else into your Asana organization, into a different team, into a different project, you could always add them to this project, not by email, but by clicking in here. And then you can start typing someone. This is my assistant, so I can add her to this team and then send it to her. So you wouldn't retype her email. You would just choose her from that list like you just saw. And I just want to note as well that so anything you add them to, they can see that. So they'll be able to see this entire project if you add them to this project. If you add them to a team, they will be able to see that team um, and everything within that team. However, in order to assign them a task within a project, you don't need to add them to that project. You can just assign them to that project. Like, so if I wanted to assign this, you'll see I don't have any other team members in here, but I have um, given my assistant access to like this one here. I can add her as a collaborator down here so she can view this task or I can assign her this task up here um, with this assignee option and then she can only see that task. She cannot see the rest of this project because I know that it can be uncomfortable, not maybe if you don't know exactly what all they have access to, what all they can view within your Asana. If you do want to keep things private, you can absolutely do that. You can just assign them tasks and not have them added to any team or project if you don't want to, or you can just have them into separate projects and teams and keep the rest private. Totally up to you. Just wanted to add that in there so that you knew about it. All right, so that's that. Now you know how to add a team member into your Asana account. Please let me know if you have any questions below or let me know what video you would love to see next. What else do you need help with when it comes to Asana? I got you. Just let me know in the comments below. Otherwise, I will see you again next week with a brand new video. Bye.